friends and welcome to Obsidian Soft. In this tutorial, I will teach you how to make a basic doodle app with sharing feature. You can share your doodles with friends and family using WhatsApp, email or even post them on Facebook or Instagram. So let's begin. Open up MIT App Inventor and start a new project by going to projects. Start new project. Let's call it share doodle app. Now I will upload some media. I will be uploading these square sized images that will serve as buttons in our app. So upload them one by one. So these images will serve as background for our eraser, pencil, new doodle and share doodle buttons. After uploading the media, go to screen one properties and make the screen orientation portrait. Drag and drop from drawing and animation a canvas component. For this canvas one properties, make the background color yellow, height 80%, width, fill parent and this line width I am going to make it 4.0 and I will make the paint color black okay which is actually the default too. Drag and drop from layout a horizontal arrangement and put it below the canvas. Make its height 15% and width Fill parent. Also make a line horizontal center, a line vertical center, and make the background color white. Now, from user interface, drag and drop a button and put it inside this horizontal arrangement. Rename it to eraser button. Okay, and make its height and width both 50 pixels. Just remember to press OK. Now choose the eraser image that we had uploaded in the media as its image and remove the text from it. Okay, duplicate this eraser button by selecting it and pressing Ctrl C, Ctrl V for Windows or Command C, Command V for Mac OS. Rename this to pencil button. Okay. And I'm just going to change the image to the pencil image. Okay. Again, duplicate, rename to clear button, and I'm going to change the image to the blank page one. Okay. And last, again, duplicate, rename to share button, and change the image to the share image that we had uploaded. Now this is important from the social palette this one drag and drop a sharing component okay so our screen design is done so let's go to the block section when someone drags his or her finger on the canvas canvases this canvases dragged event is triggered so let's get that and inside this, we want to call the canvases draw line procedure. So, again from canvas, get this procedure, draw a line. So, x1, what is x1? It is the previous positions x. Similarly, the previous positions y. And what is x2 and y2? This is the current positions x. So get current x and get current y. Okay. When someone just touches the canvas, we only want to draw a circle there. So again, go to canvas and get its touched event. And we want to draw a circle when this happens. So again, go to canvas and call the canvases draw circle procedure and here 
the center x and center y is the point at which we touch the screen. So just hover over it and you can get the getter for it, okay? The get block. And what is the radius? Now our line width is four, so our radius will be two. So go to maths and make it two, okay? When eraser button is clicked, what will happen? We are just going to change the canvas's paint color to whatever the canvas's background color is. However, this doesn't work for iPhones. So to make sure that it works even for iPhone, what we're going to do is we're going to use the actual color that we chose as the canvas's background, that is this yellow color. So when the eraser button is clicked, so get its click event, I am going to set my canvas's paint color, this one, to the yellow color. So if I go to colors, I can get the, this color yellow block, which is the same as the color that we chose as the background in our designer for this canvas, okay, this one, okay. And what happens when the pencil button is clicked? We want to change the paint color back to black color. So let's just duplicate this one and change this to pencil button and change this to black, okay? And what happens when the clear button is clicked? Let's just duplicate this one and change this to clear button. And before setting the paint color to black, we just want to clear the canvas by calling this procedure call canvas.clear. So it will clean up the canvas and, and it will set the paint color back to black. And last but not the least, when our share button is clicked, what we're going to do is we're just going to call this sharing components procedure call share file. Okay. And what is the, the thing that will come here? It will be Go to canvas and get this block. Call canvas.save. Okay. So when the share button is clicked, just share the file returned by canvas.save procedure. Okay. So this simple doodle app with sharing feature is done. And you can refine it further by adding color buttons or even a color palette by following my previous tutorials on making drawing apps. I hope you liked learning this easy and fun app. Please like my video and share it with your friends and family. Also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, kindly do so so that you don't miss any of the great projects that I've planned for you. Thank you for watching this class. Have a good day and goodbye.